Hello friends and welcome back for some more uh, Black Clover. Uh, so today we are at episode 140 and you know, I will be so boring because like I said last time, uh, it will be probably about another character of the Black Bull squad. So it will be, it will be either for one character or maybe two. Since the two last episodes were about only one character, it was Zora and uh, Vanessa. And the one before was obviously Charmy and Gr uh, no wait wait Charmy and Gordon. I think I will continue with uh, two theories. Okay. Oh no, it, it couldn't be a theory because it's just 50-50, Okay. So I will go with. I think it will continue. You know that way, and we will see one other character uh, seeing what kind of training they will do and stuff like that. So I think. I'm stuck on Magna and Vanessa and still, va still, wait, what was I about to say? <laughs> since, yeah, it was like since, no, not still, but yeah, since the last episode was Vanessa, I'll go with Magna for this one. Maybe it would be two characters, maybe not. I think it would be only one because we have a couple episodes left to go before we reach the next arc. So yeah, I think I'll go with just one character and it will be Magna. But before we get started, started, man, it's like one o'clock. I can, I can, in the morning. Uh, so yeah, before we get started, I just wanted to say a big thank you to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your trust and your support over at this platform. And if you want to join us over there, I am currently watching a Gintama. I started that this week and I'm pretty sure it will be amazing. So yeah. Uh, I said this week. This is will this will probably be early releases, so it's not this week. <laughs> but yeah, I started Gintama two episodes per week, just like Dragon Ball two episodes per week. And uh, with that, uh, like I said, I am doing early releases of Black Clover and JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. If you are interested, just look at the tiers and see what's in what. And I have many many um, Patreons, animes only and like YouTube full reactions, like I just said. Uh, so yeah, the link is in my description box. If you want to support me over there, I will be so grateful for that, guys. And without further ado, let's just get started. You know, <laughs> Julius is so adorable. And normally, like in the last episodes, I could tell by like the first five seconds with which character we were going to be. But we'll see, guys, we'll see. Maybe it will be a mix. Or maybe it won't follow the same beat as usual and we won't just see one character but like a bunch of them together. And obviously since we are seeing this situation right now, I really wonder how long it will take Julius to just get his magic back. Like would it be early enough, like before the war, maybe after, will we see him again at some point? with you know his power back and just his normal form we'll see oh my god guys so we are back with the crew so my theory was just completely wrong so i'm so hyped because obviously we'll just see the group together obviously they are not done with their training but you know different kind of vibes i love that do, do you remember how no what yo he's buff sometimes i can has to just be more buff than this whoa she, he cut through her dragon roll like so easily but yeah i was like do you remember how she was training like in the first episode and she couldn't hit any shit and right now she's throwing dragon water dragon at people Sally's back. <laughs> the white mushroom. Uh, but you know what? I think she can be a great opponent. Like, they are not that used to fight Sally. And she has an interesting kind of magic. That they couldn't really handle that easily. Last time, you know? Or the first time, at least. Whoa! Dang! What? I almost shocked every time Asta is showing his muscle. 
I don't know, he never... He doesn't look that buff, you know, with his, like, cape on. Damn, he's buff. And he's, what, like, 16 years old? He's a flippin' teenager and he's buff like heck. But yeah, he's training hard for it. That's why he's strong. <laughs> part of that shit. <laughs> oh my god, this is so great. Oh my god, how they were everyone in the door and they were just like, ah, no thanks. <laughs> that was so great. Just don't tell me they will train on each their side for like escaping her salamander. That could work. Oh my god, seems like it's going to be easy. How can she have a, syring a syringe that big in her knowing Magna's power? Whoa, whoa. Yo, she did it. Yo, she's so smart and so scary. Hang on a second, hang on a second, he's exploding. Ah, it was too much. I think it is, girl, I think it is. It was way too easy for you to just like, okay, just this, it will work. Like I said at the other people before, she's smart, she knows, she knows. Oh, boy, boy. Where did she just take those huge syringe? Too much again? I think it's too much. Oh, my God. No flipping way. It's like sign Sally on the top of it. Oh, man. Everyone just, nah, didn't work. Did something happen? Ah, oh, man. It just it didn't work on anyone. Uh, she doesn't seem that much affected by it. Yeah, come on, Sally. But still, I'm like, come on, Sally. But she didn't do any really research before with them, you know. So it was good. Yo, I really hope she won't dissect him. Like, cold. Oh! That's it? Yo, what the heck is wrong with that piece of hair? And she took a, a, a chunk of it. Like, clearly, we, we will see it. Man, what? Okay. <laughs> I'm like Sally touching Asta like that. Uh, Noel will be jealous. Uh, wait, what? Just go with the nail clipping and maybe a sample of blood, but like, eh, wait. Oh. She's like, oh, you're so kind. You're letting me experiment. <laughs> Sally. Don't you dare slack Oh, Is it the first time she's being praised or something like that? Oh. I think it's the first time. Oh, and yeah, it, she has a different purpose. And she has people like that truly care about her. So that must be so weird. For her, I mean, but I, I appreciate it. Like, we can see that Sally is not, like, deep down a bad person. Man, and I thought it couldn't be a doper 
We have Fugalion and Nozel together going to a village to just see what's going on and just take care of villains. Yo, I can be more served. Served. Whew. Let's go. Oh my god, and conceal their identities? Oh, oh, I love that because every time they're showing up like their powers is always such an entrance and just so low. I hope they will do it. They will be like, we're captains, hell yeah! <laughs> Sorry, I'm just way too into it. Yeah, I was like... Definitely they have the two worst people to blend in. Oh my god. This will be funny though. So cringe that it will... Uh, what? Oof. This is not looking great at first. It's funny that Mercs, Marks, is with them at least. That's great. I really love him even so we're not seeing him a lot. Oh no, no, no. What will he be saying? Kronovala? Oh! What? Is it a nickname for like the Wizard King? Uh, the whole Oh, it's her! <laughs> it was uh, the Wizard King in disguise, right? In the first episode or so? Oh my god. Kronoas is Julius! Oh man, the change of just personality of everyone was just great. Okay. Okay, okay. Maybe they will have their informations. <laughs> Even as an old woman, they respect you. He got the tricks with people. Uh, oh my, my. Like, they will just be talking about her. And they won't have their informations. Come on, guys. And let me guess. When they will be staying, the bandits or whoever... Destroy the village every time will be showing. Yeah, I think it's a great idea idea to stay. Just don't tell me the bandits are like people from the village. Oh my god, it looks so much like that. Yo, maybe it's not, but they look so much like the people from that village. It is. That's them. Why are they doing this? Like, are they doing this like to just create a story and that's why... The people just don't come there. <laughs> Fuck yes! The entrance! Even though they were already there, but like, the appearance, hell yeah! Uh, so they will have. Yes, this is so weird. Stop eating my tree, Sushi! You're breaking the moments! Nah. He will say something that he needs to do something, but like, you know, that is obvious, like helping the village or whatever. Like, it's true, they were so just occupied with their own kingdom that obviously there were other villages that needed help, but it just went just passed by because like i said the old kingdom was just in rumble 
Aww. <laughs> That's so nice. Aww. Yes, and he's just so loved by everyone. Ah, this episode was so great. Okay, friends, so that is it for today's episode of Black Clover, and I am just so sorry. My sushi, my sushi, yes, my cat sushi is just she can't stop herself from eating my fig tree. And uh, what are you playing with? Oh uh, no, sushi! No! She was playing with that. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, this episode was so great just by the fact that. You know, they kind of changed the formula kind of a bit, like for what? I think at least four episodes, we were seeing like every member of the Black Bull Squad like more in depth and just about their training and everything. And this episode was obviously a bit like the first half, more about Sally and just everyone from the Black Bull Squad. And then we had the second half that we had two, you know, captains of the Magic Knights. So I think it is so great and it will be so hard obviously for my next theories like at, in my intro because from now on it can just go in so many ways. It can go like training with the Black Bull Squad, it can go, we will see more, uh, you know, captains, it can just go in so many ways that it will be so hard to just guess what will be happening in those future episodes. But I know it will be great and I just can't wait to watch it. Obviously, favorite moment of today's episode, it was Nozel and Figoli on like, I don't want to say apparition, apparition, uh, appearance, whatever. Um, when obviously they just showed themselves like who they were and everything. And, you know, I wasn't even shocked to see that the Bendis were just like, the own villagers because when we talk when we think about it they never answered the question that Fugolion was asking in the first place and it was just obvious they were just too many bandits they just knew who they were uh, where they were and yeah and obviously their faces i was like Yo, they look so much like people we saw earlier on and it was a villager so yeah obviously uh the reveal of those two captains were so great. Uh, it was my favorite moments. Like moments like that are just always so dope, so great. And I appreciate every minute of it. <laughs> so yeah, this was my favorite moment. You can tell me what was yours in the comments, in the comment section. So thank you guys so much for watching and we will see each other in my next video. Bye-bye.